Now we review ditched. As in, you're in a ditch. This is a scary movie. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am Richard. This is Random Street Theater, and I have seen the 2021 thriller slash brain bender ditched. Before I get into that, let me remind you, of course, for a thousand subscribers I get, I do purchase one of these bracelets or the like from the company 4Ocean. 4Ocean pulls a pound of trash out of the ocean every time I do that, so if you would be so kind as to comment, like, and subscribe, you'd be doing your part for a better world. Now, ditched. An ambulance crew and a few police officers, I think, or a police officer or two, as well as a, a psychopath and a convicted criminal all wake up in an upside-down ambulance in a ditch. Well, no, they don't. One of them, at least, wakes up in the forest, and another one wakes up in a squad car. But basically, you have an upside-down ambulance, a squad car, and a bunch of people in a ditch on the side of the road. And, you know, when they try to leave, a bunch of people wearing Special Forces sniper suits make sure they can't. Yeah. This movie, for the first half, I'd say, is extremely effective. And as it rolls down to its inevitable conclusion, it loses some of its effectiveness. There is a question at a certain point whether these people running around are real or supernatural in nature. That question is answered a little too early. And then you're left with a movie that's well, not terribly plausible. Now, I do think this classifies as a brain bender because you can't watch the five, first five minutes of this film and be like, oh, okay, so that's what's happening. All right? There are reasons you can't do that that are not necessarily story-related, but that, that's the point. I mean, yes. You know, this is, this is a movie, it feels, it has a certain element where you think it might be supernatural, and then it doesn't. And again, you know, the, the lead lady is a very solid actress. She's the best defined character. That sort of um, psychopath they wake up with, he is another interesting piece to this particular film. And again, if you enjoy horror movies and thrillers, I think you'll probably enjoy this movie. It is a little on the slow side, and it is a little on the mystery side, but it is a solid film, and it's quite enjoyable. There is not a huge amount of gore, but there is gore, and there are strong emotions, and a surprisingly large cast to this particular film, really. So, I mean... Given the script, I don't think they could have done any better. I really don't. I think that they, they, they brought this film to the full potential of the script. And again, whereas this is not going to be, say, Nightmare on Elm Street level, this is certainly a solid horror film, and you should definitely watch it. So, so that's my recommendation, is that you put this on your watch list, Somewhere in the middle of your watch list, in fact, Ditched is a fine film, and whereas it is a little on the predictable side for me, it is not uh, bad in any way. It is a film that will keep you riveted for, for a certain amount of time. I mean, it's excellent, excellent filmmaking. I mean, it is the best use of budget and location I have seen in quite some time. And I have to say that compared to a lot of other movies... Ditched is a fine film. So yes, put this on your watch list and somewhere in the middle. It is not a must-watch. Don't run out, but if you can, definitely watch this movie. You owe it to yourself. You're really missing something if you miss this. So anyway, but that's just my opinion, and I'd love to hear yours. Down in the comments below, I'm Richard. <coughs> Alright, humans. Randall the Rat here, and you can see I'm sporting some bling. I'm reminding you to comment, like, and subscribe so that Richard, the man that owns this channel, can buy this bling. And why would you do that? Because each one of these, each one of these necklaces is from the Conqueror. 
and they represent five trees, five glorious trees that are full of birds and worms and other things that I love to eat that Richard has paid to have planted. Yes, that's right. He walks, he buys these, they plant trees. So all you have to do is comment, like, and subscribe so Richard can afford to go places where he walks, where he can get medals like this and plant trees, and you could have a better, greener world. Isn't that worth it? So, lazy human on that computer, comment, like, and subscribe. Better world for you, better world for me, and maybe I won't eat your face! Randall out.